Hello and welcome to an Aquamorph production tutorial. I'm Christian and today I'm going to be showing you how to convert aspect ratios using Sony Vegas. The first one I'm going to be using is going to be using Sony Vegas Pro. It's about $600 so not everyone can afford it so I'm also going to be showing another way that works with all the Sony Vegas um, video editing software so you can get the cheaper version so it's like $40. So the two different ways depending on which software you have. Um, if you're going to convert, if you want to convert aspect ratio, you're probably going to have to spend some money to get some good editing software to do it. So I'm just going to be showing how to do it for brick filming in Sony Vegas. So let's start off by opening Sony Vegas. Alright, so to start off, you're going to want to import your project media, which is pretty simple. Just go to import media. So I'm going to select all of it because I want all of it. And to start off, I'm going to be showing you the way how it works with um, Sony Vegas Pro. Um, it's a very nice feature. So to start off, if you notice, this is in 4x3. Also, my pictures are also in 4x3. So I'm going to switch to Full HD 16x9 because I personally prefer it. So here we go. And now it's in 16 by 9. Now the first thing I'm going to do is import this onto a track here. And if you notice, there's these little black bars. That's because this video is in 4 by 3. Now I want to convert it to 16 by 9 because 16 by 9 right now is practically the standard and it's what everyone uses. And my webcam only takes 4 by 3 photos in high quality. So I'm going to go to here and click. 3D Source Alpha, and then click this button right here, the motion track, and you want to make sure these two buttons are selected, otherwise your aspect ratio will change, it will make the picture look weird, and all you're going to do is you're going to zoom out and get rid of those black lines, and now it's in 16 by 9 It cuts off a little bit of the top and bottom, so if you're filming, you want to be aware of this. So now if I play through it, you'll notice that it plays just like it would. I don't have to edit all the friends myself. And it's now in 16 by 9 So that's how it works with Sony Vegas Pro. Um, I'm going to delete this and show you how it works in another way to do it. So the, another way to do this in the cheaper versions of Sony Vegas first insert a new video track. What I did is I already rendered out the video. So it's rendered out in 4x3 but I want it in 16 by 9 so I can click this little um, box shape thing, I click that and I want to make sure that this and this are selected I'm going to zoom in about there, something's a little miss skew so then I can take this off and adjust it till it's perfect So once you get adjusted to your perf so it's perfect, you just re-render it out and now it's in 16 by 9 So that's simply how you do it in both versions of Sony Vegas. It's pretty easy. I personally like having Sony Vegas Pro because it's so much quicker to do it. It's just kind of expensive. So if you can afford to get it, I'd personally suggest it. Well, that's all for this tutorial. Um, hope to see you back on my channel. And please subscribe.